got Nathan Adrian here. So, dude, tell us a little bit about the uh, Navy, the, the dark Navy, midnight Navy ins inspiration. Uh, the midnight, the midnight like well, uh, vel velvet is the fabric of the season. Yep. I learned this from my awesome girlfriend uh, <laughs> who's in fashion. There you go. I saw this at the store and I was like, velvet, huh? And she was like, yeah, that's totally the, uh, the, the fabric of the season. I was like, all right, let's do it. So, uh, you know, when, when else am I going to be able to rock one? I love it. It's a good look, man. So how's, uh, how's the cold New York winter treating you compared to Berkeley? Dude, I've already, like, lost my voice. Like, I need to go buy some chapstick. I, this, is not, this is not my thing. Yeah, I'm, I'm struggling a bit, too. So you're back at Cal. Uh, you started training again some. What, what's on your plate next? All right, so I don't call it training yet. Uh, <laughs> it's, it's called working out. Um, so, like, when I'm in San Francisco, I, I'm hitting all those practices. That's fine. Uh, when, I'm, when I'm out here, I'm, I'm hitting my weights workout and then doing the best I can in the pool. Um, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go to Colorado Springs with those guys like I usually do and try to use that as a little bit of a platform to build off of for the summer season. Okay, cool. So no big meets then until the summer? Uh, I mean, it dep depends how you define big meet. But, You're always you know, fast. So. We're going we're gonna to try to get going um, probably, I think, in like February or so. So, I mean... Like I said, I mean, I'm, I'm not completely out of shape, but certainly not at the point where I'd, I'd be comfortable with my times going into a big meet. Awesome. So you've been to a couple Olympics now, three actually. Yeah. So what was different about Rio? Tell me about the experience there. I mean, you obviously killed it in London. You had a great games in Beijing. Give me a, run, a quick rundown on Rio. All right. So Rio, <laughs> people ask me this all the time, and I kind of say it's like being a parent and, and someone asking you, like, who, what's your, well, who's your favorite kid? Because um, each one was different, and each one was different because I was in a different place as a person. Um, I, I got to experience it differently as an athlete because I was obviously in a different place as an athlete, um, and then even as a human. I mean, I'm, I'm 27 this year. I was, I was 19 in Beijing. Like, those, those are two very different ages. Um, you, you experience the world differently. You'll experience the Olympics differently. That's great. That's, that's an awesome answer. Well, good luck moving forward, and thanks for taking the time to talk with us. Yeah, good to see you, man. Yeah, see you.